folks what's up it's Carolina the cat daddy i know <clears throat> it's been a while since y'all seen me um there's been a lot going on in my life currently working a lot i'm on like two jobs at once uh i haven't been doing a lot of fishing i've been doing a little bit of fishing actually me and junior just went and fished the nc cats tournament we've done pretty well look at these guys that's some good fish too, shit. 20, 30 pounds. Hey, do I go? My muscles are already pulling. I'm going to beat that 75. That's 75. Frank, look. Hey, that's a big bag. Okay. Just cut off, man. Big fish. Man, just cut off. That's nah, recording. It's a screen. Goes away. Right. Total weight. Move. 62.9. Didn't really pull the GoPro out. You know, I don't usually pull the, pull the GoPro out when I'm when I'm doing tournaments. Sometimes I will, but a lot of times I won't. And we caught over 31. We caught 31 fish this day. We finally ended up with a uh, 37 blue and a 26 flat. We got fifth place. We lost third place by two pounds. So we've done pretty good. We, we actually had a really good time. We're going to fish another tournament this weekend. Um, I got a girlfriend now, so I've been like, I don't know. Been kind of doing that too, you know, so... This is a trip I took <clears throat> beginning of the year. I had camped at Santee for two days, and I come back home, and I camped in Wally for three days. And on the third day of this trip, I caught COVID. I got stuck on the boat. I couldn't get off the boat. It hit me really hard. I had to. It took everything I had. I, I got up off the bottom of the boat. I laid down because it hurt so bad. And, you know, I sleep on the boat sometimes. So I laid down, couldn't sleep. So I got up. I had two or three fish on and I just, I took everything. I was about to cut all the lines. Like it was that bad. Like I got them in through, through the rods in the bottom of the boat, got to the landing. It's a private park. I got the landing, tied my boat and went home, left my tent and everything out there, went home, slept for like two days straight. And uh, my dad actually come down here and got, uh, come down to the landing and got all my stuff. But, uh, this is that trip. Um, caught some fish, but, uh, we're gonna get back on this. I'm sorry I haven't been on here. It's just it's just been life. It's been a lot to it. There's a lot there's a lot of work that goes with this right here. So I'm sorry I haven't been on here, but we're gonna try and get back at it. And uh, thank y'all so much for watching. God bless y'all. What's up, folks? Carolina Cat Daddy. We out here playing around in the real cold weather. I got something feels like a decent fish here. 
We're actually... We're actually trying to crappy fish. And, uh... Oh, that ain't bad blue. That definitely ain't a bad blue. Nice healthy one. For sure. Oh yeah. Nice healthy one. Come on man. Give me the hook. There you go. This was a much bigger fish at one point in time. He's starting to gain his weight back. He's skinny though, but he got a, a big old head on him. We're gonna keep on fishing. All right, we're out here, January 2nd. It's been weird weather, y'all. We, uh, we was up in the 80s all week long. Did some trips down to San T, camp down there. Came back up here and it got rain for about three or four days straight and then it got cold. We're back down and it's probably down to twenties right now. It was thirty two when I launched. Pretty sure it's in the twenties now. Um I'm good and warm. I got me some new boots. Um these things are awesome. Like my feet are actually I feel like they're on fire. These things are they're working good. I ain't even crunk the heater up, y'all. All night long I ain't crunk the heater up. Well, I've been out here, caught some bait, caught some perch. And then come set up. I've probably been set up 30 minutes. But uh, on the way over here, there's fish everywhere active. A lot of fish active. So we're trying to catch some crap. And I caught a couple. We got them in the basket over here. They ain't, they ain't no monsters. They're about like this. Papa likes to eat them whole, so I keep them a couple like that. I'll keep them about three or four like that. And then the rest of them, if they ain't big, I'll let them go. But, uh, that's a decent fish, so we're gonna keep fishing. We've been catching crappy all night. Caught one channel and had another catfish on. I finally got us another catfish here. Yeah. He was pulling the heck out of some drag to begin with, but I don't know. He ain't all that. Flashed crap at me. <laughs> I guess he didn't like me calling him saying he wasn't all that. Now he wants to fight. How you doing, man? How are you doing? Fighting. He ain't, he ain't that big. He ain't that big. I ain't gonna net you. I'm gonna insult you. I ain't gonna net you. Nice one when you grow up. Yeah, you got the jeans for it, but you got a little bit of weight on it. Ain't bad. Come on now, ain't no sense doing all that now. Look at that, you about to squeeze your eyeball out of there. Uh-huh. We are camping out here. 
So uh, we'll be fishing for a couple more days, but uh, I'm about to call it. Graphic quit biting. So uh, that dumb. You not my light. You not my day heat off me, man. Boy, that's you're messed up now. Yeah, you're messed up now. Oh, he thinks it's funny. He thinks it's funny, y'all. He tore the heat off. He didn't tear it off. He took, he slapped the heat off. There he is. Got a big old bull head on him. He's gonna be a nice fish one day. But you ain't one now. He's a little guy. Get out of here. All right, we got day breaking. Um, dang, I had the light on y'all. Sorry. Ah, uh, like I said, I let my bait go. I, I threw my bait back. I do got some perch in here that I, that I caught. Could cut some of them up. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know. I'm gonna go to sleep. <laughs> so I don't know what we're gonna do. Got another one. Tell you what, this fish about made me jump out my dang seat. He ain't that big, but he took off so dang hard. Smaller than both the other two that I caught tonight. Dang. I looked over the rod was in the water. I could tell since I picked it up, he ain't had no weight, but. Dang. That ain't big enough to keep me out here. I'm ready to go to sleep, y'all. I'm telling you. I don't know where my grip is going. These fish, the fish with Santee were doing the same thing. They had a lot of energy, and usually this time of year, they, they don't have this energy. It's crazy. Now, we have have a lot of warm weather, but this is crazy. Right, I'm about tired of playing with you. Come on. Look at this little fish. This guy was doing all that ruckus. Well, this girl. Look at that. <laughs> you better stop. You hit that heater, you're going to regret it. Oh, there you go. I'll let her go. decent one here we're trying to catch big fish that's what we're going for big fish we marked some big ones back here but this, this ain't one of them be a big boy one day. He's got a big old head on him. Ah, come on now. Calm down. What? Still got plenty of energy. All the fish we've been catching lately has got plenty of energy. 
down into the 30s, down into the 20s the last three nights. Actually, last night I didn't get as cold. I've been out here three nights in a row on Wiley. And then two days before that I was on CNT. So, tonight it's not as cold. I just now turned the heater on. It's probably low 40s, 38, 39, something like that. It ain't got super cold yet, but uh, we've been sitting in this spot about an hour and a half, maybe an hour, hour and a half, somewhere around there. So uh, this actually ain't the spot I wanted to go to. The spot I wanted to go to is on up, but I marked two really good fish right here, but they was up and it was moving. It was around some brush, but from the looks of the sonar, they was moving around. So kind of hoping I could catch them moving around in here. Um, uh, we're going to give it another probably 30, 45 minutes and we're moving to another spot where I marked a bunch of fish last night. I was crap fishing, marked them, and I just left them alone. There's a bunch of fish, bunch, bunch of fish. So hopefully they're doing the same thing tonight that was last night. All right, y'all, that's the end of the video. Thank y'all so much for watching. If y'all new to the channel, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button for me. Um, I'm going to throw up a couple of my older videos y'all can go watch if you're new to the channel. Um. Thank y'all so much. We're going to start trying to do some live feeds. I talked about doing this last month and I got, you know, everything happened with me. So I haven't, I didn't do anything last month and I'm sorry, but I'm about to get on it, y'all. Thank y'all so much. We're about to get the boat back too. My dad should have my motor back together in the next day or two. So we're going to have the boat back on the water. So we're going to be, we're going to be fishing hard and we're going to have a motor, not fishing out the boat with just a trolling motor. So it's going to open up a lot more opportunities of fishing. So thank y'all so much. God bless y'all. We'll see you on the next one.